Um, they call this the uh, uh, Sherman was the golden buckle on the cotton belt. I came back to my hometown, Sherman, Texas, to find the beauty in the small town I grew up in. It was a quiet town. My grandmother agreed that things had changed. I think it's just like the world is going to come to Sherman. And um, I, I find that astounding. Downtown was emptier than ever. Any, any small town like this, you had family-owned businesses. You know, you had three generations of hall furniture. You had Samsel Groceries. His father was a grocer, and he was a grocer. Uh, my own husband, his, his father was a printer, and so he was a printer. And, you know, and all that is, is, is passe. My town looks like every other town now. The little general store that we used to have downtown that you went to get everything. Now, Walmart is our general store where you go to get everything. I used to come home and everywhere I went, someone knew me. It felt safe. It was a community where people looked out for each other. When my dog jumped through the plate glass window chasing the postman. In 15 minutes, in 15 minutes, I had 10 phone calls from people who had passed by to see that there was a hole in my front window. And I just, I just don't know that that would happen now. Uh, uh, I, I think anytime you, you lose the sense of community, uh, you build, um, uh, it, it, it's open floodgates on crime, on disinterest and uh, in the community. But it's, it's different when people are moving in and out so rapidly. Coming home wasn't easy. I barely recognized my town. And I wonder if the sense of community that made Sherman such a caring place to grow up in will ever return. Mm -hmm.